Would you guys like to see how the baby leg bars are doing underneath my little silky mama hen? Hello, sweet mama bear. How are you? How are the babies this morning? How are you, little sir? Do you have any more babies under there? Can I take a look? Well, you have an egg. Somebody's laying eggs in there. That's nice. What about that little baby who needed help hatching out yesterday? There was a little shrink wrap chick. There she is. This was a little shrink wrap baby who I helped out yesterday. And she's a little girl. You still look a little, uh, a little messy. That's okay. You'll get cleaned up. Are you doing okay? Are you happy to be in the world? I'm glad you're here. Now we'll see how that little one does. Oftentimes when I have to help chicks out of eggshells like I did her, they're weaker and they don't always survive. But also I can't just leave them knowing that they're struggling and they're absolutely not gonna survive if I don't help them out. This reminds me, I've been getting a lot of questions from people about how long can I leave chicks in the incubator once they start hatching. And this mama hen is a really great example because her chicks started to hatch yesterday morning. So these chicks have been hatching for like 24 hours right now. She's still in this nesting box up off the ground. She has not taken her first hatched chicks out to start scouring for food or drink water at all yet. And it's been 24 hours. She'll probably sit here for at least another 24 hours because she's got two more eggs in her clutch that haven't hatched yet who are fully developed. I don't know if they're going to hatch or not. I suspect one of them probably will and one of them won't. But the point is that chicks have about 24 to 72 hours from the time that they hatch until the time that they need to start eating or drinking because one of the last things that happens before they hatch is they absorb the rest of the egg yolk, which gives them all of the nutrients they need for like the first three days of life. That's why we can ship chicks too. That's why we can ship chicks that have just hatched and as long as they're shipped like immediately they do just fine in the mail for those first three days because typically they're not really eating or drinking in that time anyways. They're still sort of just getting acclimated to this 3D world that they were just birthed into.